An honor for members of a local mosque who jumped into action after their imam was stabbed. The number of heroes here, almost too many to count. CBS 2's Christina Fan has a story from Patterson. We hear the imam screaming, oh, somebody kill me. Manny Simran Munir recounted the harrowing moments. Congregants wrestled an armed man to the ground. He had been deep in prayer during an early morning service April 9th when there was a loud commotion from the front of the room. We see this big guy is running from the middle of the mosque with two knives in his hands. Surveillance video shows the suspect, 32 year old Seraf Zorba, stepping over worshipers to get to 65 year old Imam Sayyid El Nakib, whom he stabs twice in the back. The suspect then tries to flee, but half of the mosque chases him down. He kicked the door and foot is stuck here, and then he lost balance. That time we grab him. The mayor of Patterson, along with other dignitaries, honored the heroic actions of dozens of worshipers Monday, commending their bravery in restraining the suspect, who continued swinging at them with knives. You need a lot of courage in those emergency times uh, to do such a deed, such act. While the suspect was pinned down, some even interrogated him why. We asked him, who the hell are you? Why are you doing this? And you don't say anything. The imam is still recovering at home after being discharged from the hospital. We're told he's in good spirits and knows members of his mosque prevented the suspect from carrying out further damage. I wouldn't expect anything different. Um, you know, we stand shoulder to shoulder uh, every day in prayer. And even more so in times of danger. In Patterson, New Jersey, Christina Fan, CBS 2 News. Now, and at the ceremony, officials also celebrated the passing of a state bill designating H. January as Muslim Heritage Month.